What's up guys and welcome to the start of a very exciting a new series here on the channel. This my friends is Assassin's Creed Odyssey and uh, man I'm, I'm pumped. I'm always excited for Assassin's Creed every year but uh, this year is special. This year we are going to be going back to ancient Greece. We are going to be a legendary Spartan warrior a descendant of a, a warrior king, Leonidas I, and uh, it looks like it's going to be crazy. We've got uh, the return of naval battle this year. We've got like huge, you know, 100, 150 versus 150 person battles, like all kinds of crazy stuff going on. So it's going to be awesome. And as you guys may notice, we're uploading this a little bit early. So thank you so much to Ubisoft for sponsoring this video. They hooked me up with the game early. They let me upload early and share it with you guys early. And uh, I'm really appreciative of that. So uh, without further ado, guys, let's go ahead and get into it. We're going to start up a new game. And let's see what Assassin's Creed Odyssey has to offer. We are ready, my king. Tell me, Danakis, have you ever gone fishing with your son? No, never. A soldier's life is all I've had the honor to know. <laughs> I would have liked to have gone fishing with my son. Oh man, here we go, boys. Spartans! Every breath that you have taken has led you to this moment. Every drop of blood, sweat, and tear, all of it has led to where you stand right now. Persians come to make slaves of us all. I have a better idea. I say we drench the gods with their blood. What say you, Spartans? For our sons! For our daughters! For Sparta! <laughs> Dude, what? This is what I'm talking about. Those huge battles. This is going to be so much fun, dude. Are we about to hop in this? I got a feeling we're about to hop in this. <laughs> no way. Oh, <laughs> dude, he is no joke. All right, R1 to light attack. I'm down for it. Here we go. I am King Leonidas, and you can't touch me, baby. L1 plus extra bull rush. Oh, my God. I'm trying to... This dude's running from me. Where are you running to, dude? Bull rush him, dude. Beautiful work. All right, that's one down. We need to, uh, I think we need to, if we lock on, can we lock on to him? I'm going to lock on to this dude. There we go. Yes, sir. That's how we do it. He's down. <laughs> dude, this is brutal. Let's take out this little guy since he's trying to get some. And then we have this dude over here, and that's it. Little guys try to come to his defense, not gonna work. Oop. Gotta dodge, baby. He's down. All right, we got somebody over here now. Oh, there's a Spartan getting beat up over there. Oh. 
R3 to lock on. All right, here we go. Okay. Oh, hold, hold square to extend your dodge. All right, I got it. Let's get some, some licks in. R2 to break guard. There it is. All right, I see you. I'm gonna rush at him. Gotta make sure we dodge in time, though. That Spartan rush is pretty insane, I'm not gonna lie. Oh, he's done. That's it. Good night. Dude, that like rush attack is insane. You can't even block it. That was pretty awesome. We are betrayed, my king. Jerxes knows of the path behind the mountain. They are coming. <laughs> By dawn, you will be completely surrounded. We are Spartans. When are we not? Spartans. That word will mean nothing. Xerxes wipes your bloodline from the face of you. Today was a day the Persians will never forget. Oh. Tomorrow is a day the world will remember. Here we go, boys. Oh my gosh, this is going to be insane. Going back to 431 BCE. <sighs> Ancient Greece, going to become a Greek warrior. A man of Sparta. I mean, this is, um, this is going to be pretty intense. I'm excited. I, I, I think that, like, just that opening battle, like, there, there's a lot, a lot coming our way, boys. Is this our hawk? Oh, we caught dinner. Oh, he dropped it. Dude, it'd be so cool to be a bird. I know that's kind of random and off topic, but like, look at this view. Imagine being able to just like fly around, swoop around, do whatever you do, do bird things. Alexios. What's up, you legend? Hey! Shit face! <gasps> Get down here! <laughs> Cyclops got a message for you. Tell your boss he can stick it. That's for last week! <laughs> Malaka! Oh, we're we're fighting, baby. We're fighting. I want an R1 to parry. Okay. Oh, oh, nice. All right, that's important to know. 
The Cyclops always Break his guard. You have a lesson to learn. If the Cyclops wants to teach you, go ahead and parry him. There it is. Night, night. Dude, he's a beast. Last week? <laughs> this shit happens every week. <sighs> I can't keep doing this. <whistles> nah. Thanks for the warning. <laughs> A little bit late on that warning there, bird. What happened to you? It's nothing, Phoebe. All taken care of now. The Cyclops again, huh? Hasn't he learned his lesson yet? Apparently not. Of course. Help yourself. You hungry too, Icarus? <laughs> Do you think Zeus will bless me with an ego like he blessed you, Alexios? Maybe you could ask him for me. Okay. I'll try to put in a good word for you. Finally. So, what are you doing here? Oh, I almost forgot. Marcos is looking for you. Uh, what does that weasel want now? Don't know. He wants you to meet him at his new house. On his vineyard. Wait, what? A vineyard? Malaka! It's on the road to Sami. He says wine will make him rich. Well... I guess I owe Marcos a little visit. Thank you, Phoebe. <coughs> I'll go tell Marcos you're coming. What a little hustler. Uh-oh, the choices you make will have impacts both seen and unseen. Consider your options carefully as some affect the story and are permanent. Get out of here or kill him. We'll let him go. Fun's over. Tell that one-eyed freak, if he sends you here again, I'm going to cut his other eye out and feed it to my bird. <laughs> Icarus is like, I'll yeah, what's Marcos. up? As soon as I'm dressed. All right. Here we go. I'll have to go up top to get dressed. See what we got going on in here. Let's get this on. Open our inventory menu. Okay, Ooh, we have lots of stuff going on. Ooh. Timeless eye or cover of dusk? I'm gonna go with the timeless eye. Oh, we can't equip it right now, I don't think. It might be too early in the game. Yeah, required level five, okay. Only thing we can put on is this. The Mystios tunic. Got that. Got a common waist belt. Dude, we have full armor, but we just can't use it yet. What else do we have going on here? We've also got different spears and stuff. What's in here? Broken bow. All right. Looks good. Pretty simple inventory system. I like it. Looks good to me. And uh, now we're going to head this way. Let's head on to uh, Marcus. That's who we're trying to go talk to. Oh, you better stay away from me, bro. I thought he was about to charge us or something. It kind of scared me for a second. All right. He's in the southern part of Mount Anos. So we're going to head that way. I feel like we're in leaving Pallet Town right now, bro. The very first time. Whoa, what? Oh, ambush! Ambush! Saw a dude with an arrow over here. I'm gonna take him out. Okay. I'm trying to parry, and there's so many guys hit me all at once that it's kind of hard to parry. 
they're down. Whoo! I'll take that loot. Y'all got any loot? No? Where's that first guy we killed? Did he have loot? Nope. Alright. Dude! Alexios is kind of a beast, I'm not gonna lie, and we're like... This is the vineyard. Straight ahead. Ooh. Call Icaros. L2 to become stationary. There you are. Up Let's there. see what you've gotten yourself into this time, Marcos. I'm glad we got a bird back. I'll miss Sinu, but Icaros seems pretty cool as well. Being able to spot objectives from a long way away is always important. But yeah, dude, we, we don't have any upgraded weapons or anything, and he's just straight murking people. Ow. Sorry, bro. So you bought a winery. All right. Gosh, I, I keep telling you, you, you can't do that. Why? It's my farm. I can plant what I want. The grapes will die here. <laughs> All of them. You have to forget what you know about the past, my friend. Together, we will revolutionize winemaking. Believe me, you will look back on this day and... Oh, Alexios, thank the gods. Phoebe found you, you in time. I can still hear you. I was worried sick. The Cyclops sent his scum to find you. I think they mean you harm. I wish you would have told me that before they hit me. But that's besides the point. You bought a vineyard, Marcos? A vineyard? Why not? I like wine, you like wine, everybody likes wine. Everybody buys wine. Why not from me? Well, I mean, first of all... You don't know how to grow grapes or make wine. <laughs> I'm a fast learner. You grow grapes on the vine, then you get some wine. Oh, it's that simple, is it? You know me better than to think I don't have a plan? Marcos always has a plan. All right. Then do you have the money you owe me? Do I have the money I owe you? Uh, of course, of course. Well, no, not at the moment. Then get it. <laughs> instantly, my friend, instantly. But uh, maybe you should do that. There is a merchant in Sammy. I'm not very good at these things, as you know. You want me to collect my own debt? It's just waiting for you and Sammy, my friend. Who's the merchant? Thuris. You know Thuris. He's very nice. <laughs> Thuris. Again? Why do you keep lending him money? He's a loyal friend. I don't want his family to starve. You're a good friend, but you're bad with money. He'd better have my money, Marcos. I'd hate to have to sell our vineyard. Of course he will. Oh, after, there's another matter I want to discuss with you. After. Fine, but I'm taking a horse. It's too hot and too long a walk to go on foot. But... Think of it as interest, Marcos. Everybody benefits. Of course, my friend. You shall have your pick. All right, so we get a horse out of the deal. Not too bad. Then we're going to go collect our money that I doubt is going to actually end up being there, but we'll see. Okay, so we've got a black one, a brown one, and a white one. Tell me about this one. The Skiros. You have an eye for sturdy stock, my friend. That horse can cling to mountain passes like a god. The one in the middle. Tell me about it. Ah, you have picked a beauty, my friend. That horse is from Thessalonia, bred for its courage. I like the look of the one on the right. Ah, the Macedonian. These are bred for battle. A true warrior's horse. Sounds like that's the one for me then. Which one will it be? The warrior's horse, man. On the right. Ah, uh, a, a fine choice. But this particular breed has a few quirks that you might not be aware of. I wouldn't want you to take an unworthy horse. I think he's trying to talk this me out of it. I want. Are you sure? Because... I'm sure, Marcos. Everybody benefits, especially you. You've chosen the great Phobos. He's never let me down. Phobos. 
Remember, meet me at the temple in Sami when you have uh, your money from Duris. Ah, F. Derpy. There's plenty of wine left to buy. Don't fret. Not now, you fool. Phoebe has been taken. By who? Thugs of the Cyclops. Who else? Snatched her right off the main road. Tell me where they went. In the direction of Itimena Beach. The beach? Can she swim? I'll get her. Yes, go. But don't forget about dear Duris, Alexios. Alright. Well, we're gonna go save Phoebe. Reach the bandit camp and rescue Phoebe. Yeah, I, I think he was trying to get us not to take this horse. I think he was lying about, uh... Lying about the unwanted traits situation. I don't know. We'll see. Can you swim, Phobos? We're not gonna try, just in case you can't. There they are. I'll sneak up on the Malakas. Okay. Gonna do a little bit of stealth mission or what? Shut it, or I'll tighten those ropes. She'll make good ransom Drachmi for the Cyclops. No one's gonna buy me from you. They're all poor. <laughs> I got you, girl. Don't worry. Phoebe. Okay. Detection. Enemies will investigate if they spot your restricted area. Crouch, become less visible, and hide in the vegetation. The grass will keep me hidden. Assassinate unsuspecting enemies by pressing triangle. However, if your assassin damage is not enough to kill the enemy, you will stealth attack and enter conflict. Can't let the rest of those malakas get away. A swift kick to the nuts, baby. All right, how do we whistle? Ah, down. Eh? Who's whistling? Who's whistling? Your worst nightmare. <laughs> Oh, that was right in the butt, dude. That was pretty brutal. And that takes care of all of them. Time to get Phoebe out of here. Oop. Hold on. Alexios, I'm here. I'm I gotta get my loot first, girl. Gotta go for the more important objectives. <laughs> Are you all right? It wasn't so bad. Last time they put a cloth in my mouth so I'd stop biting. Phoebe, just be careful. You're alone now since... Since my parents died? I'm okay. I've got you and you've got me and Marcos. We're your family, right? What did happen to our family? I know we were a descendant of, uh, of Leonidas. The king we were playing with in the very opening intro. I think we're about to find out what happened. <clears throat> You'll have to be stronger than that. Don't give in! Let him have it! Oh! Got oh! You. <laughs> Again! Up! Yes, Butter. Spartan rises as soon as they have fallen. Ready or stop? Widen your stance. A soldier grounds themselves. Hmm? Good. Good. Approach me. That's enough, Nikolaus. The sun's going down. Time to eat, don't you think? <laughs> what are we eating tonight? Tonight, we are having baby Cassandra. <laughs> <laughs> and what a feast she will be. No, not her. Take me instead. I'm tasty. Yes, yes. You're all sweet as honey. Now, come inside. The lamb's turning black. Here. Lay her in bed. Yes, Butler. So we're brother and sister. That's cool. You are my greatest 
pride. Remember that. You will bring this family to glory. Go. So it seemed like we had a pretty good home life. Had a good father that was raising us to be a warrior. He was obviously a warrior himself. Had a good good family life. I don't I wonder what happened. I don't know if I want to know. Right. You worry too much. You don't worry enough. We'll be alright if we watch out for each other. Which reminds me, the thug said you should watch your back. What'd they say? They said the Cyclops put a big bounty on you. Talos the Stonefist wants you dead. Talos, the mercenary. Oh, am I ever not in trouble? Better get him before he gets you. I hear he's really mean. I'll find my way back to town. Here! <laughs> She's just gone. Talos the Stone Feast? That's just what I need today. Another broken nose. I'm going to have to take care of that. Alright. You are hunted. Bounty hunters like Talos are hostile mercenaries who will hunt you down as long as you have a bounty. Bounties can usually be paid off, but the Cyclops won't accept payoffs. Alright. Cool. Lots of bounty hunters that can be coming after us, but right now Talos the Stone Fist is the only one. He's a level 5. Pretty... Pretty high up there, but I, th I think we can handle him. I'm not too worried. Where are you at, Phobos? Phobos, you broken or what, dude? Am I gonna have to run all the way to this town? We might have to go get on a main street. There we go. There he is. <laughs> Finally showed up. Okay, so we've got to go get our money from the merchant. Breaking his wares may encourage him to pay his debt, or you can always kill him. I'm going to try to be a fairly, like, understanding and, and good man. I'm not, I'm not trying to be the savage that just runs everywhere and kills everything. Well, that might be kind of fun. Not going to lie. Doris will be at the shop. Sorry. How you doing, Doris? I heard you owe Marcus a little bit of money, which is my money now, so, uh... Let's see what we got going on. Hello, Doris. Business looks good. Tell Marcus to come down here himself, if he wants his money. Huh? Uh, but I'm here now. Look, I was a little late paying. Now Marcos says I owe him double because of interest. I don't have it to spare. Hmm. Double? That's robbery. That's what I told Marcos. You know him. He's extreme. If you pay him, this will all be over with. You told Marcos I've paid enough already. I won't bow to... to... To a mercenary, or to someone foolish enough to borrow money from the Cyclops. From the Cyclops? That's how he bought his vineyard? Oh, God. I know you'd be dead without Marcos. What with him taking you off the street as a kid. But you know what he's doing is crazy. You're right about that. Forget the drag me. Marcos and I need to have a talk. You're letting me go? Then at least take this sword. Nothing special, but it's better than that rusty one you've got. With the Cyclops involved, I'll need it. You better set Marcos straight or you're both dead. That's what I'm talking about, baby. We're going to be smart, understanding, kind, and we're going to get rewarded for it. Got a job to do, Alexios? That's, that's pretty exciting, dude. We just got a brand new sword. Now, can we equip it yet? Because I think it was a level two. If we go to our inventory here. 
we cannot equip it yet because we're still level one. But still, that's that's going to be useful as soon as we can actually level up and use it. What have you gotten yourself into, Marcus? You're running out of time until the Cyclops comes for you, Malaka. He wants his money. Could I have an extension? When he sails back to Kefalonia, he'll come and break you as soon as he docks, if you don't get it. Now, let's be civil. You can't hide behind your glories, Mistios forever, Marcos. He'll kill you, the mercenary, and that little runt girl that hangs around. Of course, not a problem. I'll get the drachmi. Good. Or I'll come and watch the Cyclops feed you to his goats. Ah, Alexios. I can tell from the smile on your face, Duris has paid you your drachmi. Who's smiling? I just heard where you got the drachmi for the vineyard. Are you out of your fucking mind? We can get the money back, can't we? I'm sure it's possible. I don't think so. You made an idiotic promise, Marcos. One we can't keep. I thought you were invincible. Maybe I am, but you're not. <sighs> I long for the old days. Remember them? They were simple. You had nothing, young and alone, and I had everything. And I gave you the world, Kefalonia, in the palm of your hand. Cassandra! Whoa, what the heck? Don't see fishes like you every day, huh? <laughs> oh. ha. You hungry? How about we make a deal? I do something for you. You do a few things for me. Everybody wins. Best offer you're gonna get. Huh? Think about it. Wait! Polonia. <laughs> Some gift. You were nothing without Marcos. And look how far we've come. From an orphan on the streets to a Mistios with a hovel. Another Cyclops will take everything away. I can't protect you from him forever. He'll kill me too. Oh, don't be scared of him. And look at you. How could I go up against him? With what weapons? A rusty spear? A broken bow? There you are. Skulking around the temple won't save you from me, Marcos. Drusilla! I was just talking about you. You were? <laughs> I need that wood, Marcos. These new bows will be the talk of the island. I can't make anything with those bandit malakes stopping the wood shipments. Of course you can. Why, I was just filling my friend Alexios in on the details. He already has a plan to deal with these bandits. Oh, I do. Me, always prepared. <laughs> what did we'll I pretend. Tell you? He will leave no stone unturned. I don't care who does it, but someone better got those bandits today. A wonderful idea. I, for one, uh, need to rush home. Alexios, I've cooked up a plan for our Cyclops dilemma. See me when you have time. If you want your wood, 
You'll have to fix my broken bow first. Hmm. I usually only pay when the deed is done, but shit's moving at a snail's pace. Follow me. Okay, I like it. Make me rich as Chrysos. They're that good, are they? War's brewing. The Athenians need good bows if they want to hold off the Spartans. Everybody benefits, I guess. Who are you? Marcos? You should be tired of this small time shit. You'd make a fortune in this war. Plus, I hear you're a secret Spartan. That was a long time ago. I'm a Kefalonian. Hand it over. There you go, good as new. That bow is as strong as Heracles himself. Give it a try. I like it, boys. Here we go. L2 to aim. R2 for a quick shot. Or you can hold it for a charge shot. Nice. Okay, check your inventory menu. You have gear that is better than what you have equipped at the moment. Go ahead and open that up. Oh, we've got our abilities too. Okay, leveling up, earning XP increases your level and awards an ability point to spend on abilities. New abilities are progressively unlocked. It could be eventually upgraded. So we've got, um, we've got some stuff down here and then we also have Hunter, Warrior, and Assassin Trees. We currently have one ability point. Time slows for up to five seconds when you're spotted by enemies. Aimed arrows lock onto the target's torso and deal 150% hunter damage. Shoes put three arrows at the same time, each deal 100% hunter damage. Zoom to shoot an arrow that deals 380% hunter damage and travels 25% farther. Hold R2 to gain control of the arrow in the air instead of charging it. Ooh. So that's like a sniper, dude. I'm, I'm getting the sniper perk. Many abilities are powered by adrenaline, which is built up by landing hits, successfully dodging or parrying enemy attacks, and many more actions. When the ability is used, one adrenaline segment is spent and must be built up again. Okay. Press where to assign this ability. All right, I'm going to I'm going to put it there. Rush through enemies. Shoot, that bull rush would have been good. There are some really good ones in here. Assassination knockout damage are increased by 20%. Automatically loot the enemy after assassination. We gotta get that. Athena's sight to reveal all secrets, including chests and hidden passages in a radius of 15 meters. All nearby enemies are tagged. We've gotta get that as well. Dude, there are so many good things here. And then we also have these down here. Oh, are these? I think we already have these. Yeah. These we already have, but we can like upgrade them. Looks like we can now use Doris' sword that he gave to us not too long ago. Since we leveled up to level two, and uh, let's... Oh, fair is fair. Are you going to get my see wood? See what Doris is Those doing. Those fucking bandits need a thrashing. Fair is fair. I'll fix your wood problem. Finally! Marco sure is lucky he's got you as his scapegoat. I'll take care of the bandits. Make sure that you do. And be quick about it. I'll deal with these bandits and get you the wood you need as fast as I can. Have patience. It won't take long. Ha! <laughs> if you knew how long Marcos has been feeding me excuses, you wouldn't be saying that. All right. All right. I did something for you. Now you do something for me. Get my wood. So where are they at? Find and investigate the ambushes, it says. Where are they, though? We've got somebody doing yoga up here. This is one of our objectives, but I don't think this is the objective we want. Mighty Kefalus, I entreat you, send us a champion, someone worthy of your mighty spear. Help your priestess in her hour of need. You called? <laughs> oh, Alexius, you startled me. Why are you looking for a champion? I need someone worthy to win the Spear of Kefalus. I've been deciphering some of the sanctuary stone carvings. They say the spear was hidden in the caves beneath Kefalonia when the temple was built. You could get it for me, couldn't you? I can give you a reward. Maybe. If the spear is in the caves, 
I'll find it. Well, maybe you were sent by Kefalus. I'll see what I can find. Oh, thank you. I'll prepare a spot in the sanctuary. So we're just stacking up on uh, on side missions right now. Let me let's let's go into our quest. I want to help out the girl that that fixed our bow. I feel like that's important. Um, so we're gonna go ahead and let's activate that. All right. So that gives us our actual objective. Looks good. Let's call in Icaros. There's somewhere. It's somewhere. Ah. Oh, that's the sphere. That's not the one we're looking for, though. We're looking for the wood one. I don't know. We could do them both. Whatever. It's not going to hurt us. Side missions aren't necessary in this game, but honestly, I feel like a lot of times you get to a point where you need to do them to level up, so it's not going to kill us to do a few early. So let's head out. We're going to go take care of this wood problem. And then we're going to go find that yep. sphere. I wouldn't imagine either one of these are going to be too difficult. Oh, look at the dog. I think that was a dog. Was that a hyena? I don't know. Come on. Here's where the ambush happened. I should look around. Ah, got to become a, a detective. A group left this area, headed west. Whoa, that's not good. Shot in the back while fleeing. Must be the work of bandits. Okay, so it's a group of bandits. The cart was emptied, then left behind. The thief can't have gotten far with that much cargo. Okay. Target's close. He said they headed west, so it's got to be over this way. That must be the bandit camp I'm looking for. All right. Let's go get him. I don't take kindly to bandits, baby. Might have to go uh, have a little word with them. See what's going on. The lumber ship. I need to sneak up on them. Okay. So can Icarus scan enemies? Looks good to me. These guys are pretty much all level twos, which I think, I think we can handle. I'm gonna go get this guy as he's off on his lonesome. And I'm gonna steal other jock me while I'm at it. Excuse me, bro. Ooh, just a punch to the butt. Better come check it out, homie. Make sure there's nobody else around. We're good. He's down. Dude, this is so sick. Should we use our sniper? Okay, this is harder to use than I thought. He has no clue where he got hit from, though. No one here, but I bet they're close. What's up, bro? <laughs> okay, so we definitely do more arrow damage. But we gotta upgrade our arrows some, I think, before we can really get one-hit kills and stuff. Can I save you? No?
I mean, that's pretty nice, I'm not gonna lie, dude. I kinda... I can dig that, I can dig that. Just be able to snipe these guys. From all angles. They have no clue what's hitting them. <laughs> You guys just see the whale in the background? Dude, what? Free Willy just jumped out there. Okay. So we're going to go acquire some stolen lumber. Bring it back to her. Let her know that uh, it's all good to go. Why does that guy have an... The eagle just took him down. We got some soft leather from it. Okay, so there's one more piece of treasure somewhere in here that we have to loot. This is why we need that one ability to be able to scan the area, because sometimes it's kind of hard to, hard to find. I would imagine it'd, it'd be somewhere in these little tents that they have set up. I'd like to be able to free this guy, but... I don't see the option that I can. He's just hanging out here. Okay. I have no clue where the other treasure is, but we're gonna head back and complete this mission. Okay. We got a wolf on us, boys. He's down, though. I'm gonna loot you real quick. I bet you got some good stuff on you. I see a couple other wolves over here. Got him. Where'd that come from, huh? Feel kind of bad about it, but at the same time, no, I really don't. They would have eaten me if they had the chance. So I'm not going to give them that chance. All right, miss. I handle business. I got your wood. We should be all square, right? Oh, look, it's Marcus's mighty champion. <laughs> Don't tell me you actually did what I asked. I tracked the bandits and sent them to Addis. Your wood should arrive in town soon. And you expect me to believe the word of a mercenary? I didn't expect you to believe me, so I brought this. Here's your proof. A sample of the special wood you want so badly. These bows you're making had better be worthy of Apollo for all the trouble I've gone to. By the gods! You sure you work with Marcos? He's never once delivered on a promise. Incredible. I might work with him, but we're nothing alike. I'm true to my word. Then take your pay. Give none to Marcos. Alright. New engraving unlock plus 2% assassin damage. 1375 XP, dude. That's not bad. We leveled up to level 3. That's what I'm talking about. Alright, you know what? Let's go for this other this other side mission too. Damage and health increase. See, it it pays it pays to be a good man is what we're learning in this game. I don't think we're going to. Uh... Oh, you know what? I'm gonna get that. Uh... I'm gonna get that ability. Let's go to our abilities here. I'm gonna get um... the assassin for auto looting. Okay. So we gotta go down in this cave, I think. Got a treasure. Where, uh, hold on. I thought we were going down here to get that stupid spear that she was talking about. Where's that spear went out? We gotta go to our, our quests. Fight with Talos in the footsteps of the god. Yeah, this one. This is what we want. It says it's close, six meters away. Is it in here? I think it might be in here. 
This makes me a little bit nervous, but we're gonna go for it. Oh yeah, that that's the angle I wanna see. Is it over here? Kind of seems like we're on the right way. On the right path. We're getting metal out of the caves, bro. This is Minecraft. They won't ask any questions. Best keep out of sight. Okay. These guys are level threes too. I don't know if a single a single assassination is gonna work, but we're just gonna have to go for it. Oh, it is. I think it's it's basically like per on a per level thing. So like level three can get level three or under in one hit. I see you over there. You coming for me? Where did that come from? I don't know. Must be one of those weird whistling birds in here or something. Okay, we got a treasure here. We got it. We got the sphere. That's it? That's all she wanted? How do we get out of here? Ah. Go ahead and grab these. I don't know the way out. I thought I saw the way out, but maybe I'm crazy. Can we just straight climb the wall? Not bad. Okay. There's more guys up here, though. Excuse me. <laughs> That's brutal. Like this, get some metal. I don't know if we're gonna be able to craft weapons with metal or what, but that's it's kind of cool, I guess. And here's our way out. All right, boys. So I would say we're we're off to a good start. Did a uh, a grand fine job here in this first episode. Completed a couple of main missions. Completed a couple of side missions, and uh, we are. We are looking pretty good, I'm not gonna lie. Let's see what she's gonna give us. Alexios, have you come back to talk about the spear? I have. Oh, good. Tell me, did you find it? Let's talk about my reward first. I'll give it to you or I couldn't find it. So we could keep the spear if we want. But like I said, we're gonna try to be a good man. What? No reward? Oh, Alexios, I'm in your debt. If ever there's a way my temple can help you, or anyone, send them here. I will remember. Okay, maybe we're just playing the long game? I mean, at least we got a ton of XP. We'll take that as a win. I, I was hoping for some money or something, but we just... We'll just have to live with being a good person, I guess. Alright guys, I'm gonna see you all in the next episode. Hope you guys enjoyed. Drop a like if you did, and uh, subscribe if you haven't already. Thanks for watching, guys. Peace out.